Hello everyone and welcome back to Golden Drifter and today we are back on the Minecraft Hardcore Survival Let's Play uh, where I did a little bit of work off camera I know stereotypical uh, Minecraft Let's Play but I couldn't stop myself and I built this little extension for the um, for the enchantment table I still need a few more bookshelves uh, but really all it was was just that is so weird. I just disappear. So cool. Anyway, um, it was pretty much just me um, massacring all the cows within a 10,000 block radius of me. And I still didn't have enough, um, I still did not have enough books to complete it. But today I want to focus a little bit less on doing this, maybe doing a bit of enchanting, but nothing for the enchantment table. And I want to start working on the aesthetics of this entire area, because we have random AFK spots, we have a fairly meh house, if I if I do say my, so myself. And, you know, cleaning up the interior a little bit, moving my nether portal, a whole bunch of things, just um, adding a whole bunch of uh, stuff. So let's collect some of our materials. I have a whole bunch of stone. Um, <clears throat> I have a whole bunch of stone for this, and some stone bricks, so let's craft all those up. Let's do that, sure. Okay, so, um, well first let's go and grab a little bit more wood, so let's jump in our trusty boat. And yeah, okay, so now we have ourselves uh, a few bits of wood, you know, uh, 40 pieces, that should be good enough for what we need now. Um, I want to quickly go and um, uh, just improve the aesthetic, so adding a little bit more details to the build, because I really can't stand um, not having a nice looking base. So we'll do that, and um, hope for a wandering trader to show up, because I need leather. So um, that's what we're doing, so let's go to sleep. Let's start, uh, cue the time lapse. guys and we are back from that very nice time lapse if I do say so myself and yeah we are starting to put um some of the chests into this tower here I still have to do the ceiling but pretty much I want chests going all the way up to the top and I have a fun way of getting up there so let's just um continue to bust down these chests and um I guess Continue um, working. Yes, I do think this is a very cool. Um, this is gonna be a very cool method if I can get it to work. So let's, let's go like this. Another chest right there. Boom. Um. Okay. So let's spam a whole bunch of stuff into a chest here. 
So I'm gonna grab some of my tools. I'm gonna go grab like about another stack of wood or so to get a bunch of chests. And we'll, uh, well, I guess I'll catch up with you guys uh, when that is done. Okay, and we're back. So now let's uh, make ourselves some more chests. We can make exactly 15 more chests, which is perfect. Okay, so do that, that, that. So now this is actually what I'm going to do. I'm put water in there. Actually. Okay. Wait. So this is what we have to do. Do that. Just a temporary infinite water source right here. So now we have to do this. Boom. 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 Like that. So now all we have to do is then grab a little bit of our soul sand. Do that. There we go. And that'll send us shooting up all the way to the top. And to get down, well, I guess we will just. Um, I guess we could just make a bunch of slabs. You know what? Let's do this. Here we go. So we go like this. And then you can just jump down without taking any damage. So that's, that's pretty cool. Eventually, I think I want to change this out for, um, slime blocks. But watch, we just simply go like this. And that also, actually, you know what, I think I will keep it like that. Just because it doubles as an infinite water source. So we go like this, and we can just simply go like that. There we go. I think that works out pretty, um, I think that works out pretty well, actually. So now, what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to get myself a new sword. And I am going to go AFK at the mob farm for just a little. Alrighty, guys, and we are back from AFKing at the um at the skeleton farmer, and I actually got a couple of enchanted bows here. You have power two and a power one, and I have a lot of iron, which means I am going to actually make an anvil. There we go. 31. So now we have to go like this. Um, perfect. There we go. Actually, no, no I want to move this. There we go. So, right there. So if we add power 1 plus power 2, power 2, okay, and then like that. Well, I'm going to combine it there. Okay, so now we have a pretty much full bow. That's still way too much fun for me. Anyway, okay, let's go to sleep. Okay, and we're here. Okay, so uh, let's go over the um, exterior aesthetics. So you can see we've added this tower on. Now I want to add like a, a nice kind of Victorian style, um, like rounded roof kind of on top of it. I think that'll look really cool. And then with all the stone bricks, maybe with some details, up the sides here, I think this will turn into a very nice looking um, uh, tower. So I'm gonna make a couple more, I'm gonna make one more axe, I'm gonna go chop down a whole whack of trees, and um, I'm going to finish up the storage unit. And then simply just jump down into the water. That's very nice. And this also doubles as the um, that. And the last thing I think I want to do today 
is just see if we can get a couple of enchantments. So, efficiency 3, we can go for sharpness 3, and I'm assuming this is going to be protection 3, fire protection 3, okay. Don't think I want that. I think I'm going to go for sharpness 3. Okay, so like that, let's go here. Sharpness 3, just sharpness 3, which is kind of bad. We can have either Unbreaking 3, Efficiency 2, not really that great, or Thorns 2. Smite 4. Yeah, okay. Efficiency 2. Okay, so we have a couple of Enchantment. Oh, by the way, I already did one enchantment on my pickaxe and I got efficiency three, but I, I grinded it off. So that's why I didn't get the achievement. Um, but yeah, I guess let's, um, I guess, yeah, I'm going to leave it here today. Uh, hope you enjoyed. If you did, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Turn on those post notifications to never miss another one of my uploads. And yeah, I will catch you in the next one. Goodbye. <laughs>